Happy Memorial Day weekend. Uh, I know it's been a few days. I've been out. I was on vacation, but now that we're back, here's everything you need to know for Memorial Day onward. And let's start with Walt Massey Ford here in Marion County. You notice that it's just about 80 degrees there in Marion County. Pretty toasty and fairly muggy, that's for sure, even though it's 10 o'clock at night. And of course, if it's any indication that summer, we got that prevailing southerly wind bringing those muggies to the area. No rain totals at this time today for many of us in the area. However, that could change as soon as tomorrow. More on that in just a moment. Many of us still kind of in those low 80s, even those high 70s. Of course, we can expect that trend to continue in the near term. Of course, some of us will drop into the 70s soon, if not already. Of course, look at that right there. You see that 3 a.m. Some of the pre-dawn hours, some of those rain chances may resume as well in the overnight hours. So, of course, starting in the overnight, some of the clouds build back in and eventually soon. So will the rain chances. I'd say we've got about 10% chance at this time, steadily rising to about 20 to 30% in the coming hours there in the pre-dawn hours in the morning, especially as we fall to about 74, 75 degrees for our overnight low and that prevailing south southerly wind there at 8 to 12 miles an hour. It will definitely be a humid one with partly cloudy skies. Then definitely the name of the game for tonight. Now. Also for tonight, right, we have some of that patchy fog in the pre-dawn hours there in early morning. However, even if you do get some fog, it ought to be fairly short-lived. I'm not expecting any major concerns. I know that you're seeing that little blip there, but this is some patchy fog for some areas. And even if it sticks around, it won't be for that long. And before you know it, it burns off in time for 9, 10, 11 p.m. Uh, I'm sorry, a.m. there. I know, right? It's 10 p.m., uh, so bear with me. But anyway... So, you can see some of those rain chances there early on in the morning, kind of, you know, rising to as much as 20 to 30, maybe even brief periods, maybe some scatter storms early in the morning, but tapering off by the time we reach midday. So once again, Memorial Day is not a washout. I know we have those rain chances there even throughout the day, but as we ride the roller coaster here up to 94 degrees, it's not really going to be all that bad for the better part of the afternoon. Here's what I'm talking about. We rise up to 94 degrees after starting around 74, 75, but the rain chances as the temperatures increase, the rain chances decrease. That's the best part about Memorial Day. So let's take a look at your future cast. You can see some of that early morning rain there. This future cast suggesting some more rain being a little more scattered if uh, there uh, early in the morning. However, it tapers off throughout the better part of the day. Maybe a few showers and thunderstorms popping up due to daytime heating there in the afternoon, but I'm not expecting any major issues there for us. So obviously that's good news there. And of course, the week ahead, we don't have a whole lot of rain chances to contend with. Wednesday is kind of a pop up there. You know, it's that summertime pattern where we get a few pop up storms every now and again, but no big washouts in our near future with plenty of warm temperatures for the foreseeable future. Trey?